is a girl she's a star she's got style Steffi star you see her face around the town she's popular Steffi star yes and you followed through and made it your dreams come true. We are. Ah. We are. Oh. Hi, I'm Stephanie Weinstein. And I'm Meredith Keach. We are top producing real estate agents with Coldwell Banker. Easton. Easton, Massachusetts. Because hey. now we have followers all around the world. So now we have to say Massachusetts. Massachusetts. We have some exciting guests today. I mean, wicked exciting. <laughs> Laura Lee, hi. hi. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. So excited to be here with Laura you guys. Lee Hunt we is have one of cute Meredith's little Lolo here. Yes. Oh, I gotta tell you guys something. Um, hello. What am I talking about? Oh, Hi, I'm Alexa. Alexa, I'm Stephanie's daughter. It's very nice to see you, Alexa. Thanks, Thanks for there. <laughs> Thank you for that warm welcome. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> something I didn't tell the Weinstein ladies what? is our guest today actually was in broadcasting. What? She was on the news. I she was. had on the outfit. I did. She went on location. Did I know this? I, don't I think know if you knew that. I might have known. It was like a whole different life. It, it was. was another it was like a past life. life. Yeah. yeah. She'd be was. on. She covered all like she, there was a snowstorm. She yeah. was there every Friday night. I used what to did you say? This is there was a house fire. Hunt. Yeah. Oh yeah. my god. I am reporting live. Did you report live? I did. Like yep. Shelby Scott. So I was out in Worcester. <laughs> which is now NECN at the time it wasn't. It was like WGMC, which is on some small, tiny cable outlet. Yeah. And now it's NECN. As soon as I left, NECN bought us. So I oh, left a little that's too That's so early. cool. But yeah. You're basically Who's a star. Um, at one point I thought I was, yep. Wow. At one point I did think why I was. Why star, didn't you though? continue? Um, because, you know what? We, I worked overnights. I was working weekends. I had no life. Oh, so and you really didn't make that much money. So mm. I wanted to be and, a drug rep instead. And you, mm. But you would have had to go to like... East Overshoe, yeah, Indiana, right? To get like on and fit like at in Boston <clears throat> on like Channel Seven, like I'd have to go around the country and work at like little small outlets that you know in the middle That's of nowhere. That's not your vibe. Making level. no money. Yeah. That sounds exhausting. Yeah. yeah, we don't like that. So I traded in my um, microphone for mm. a drug bag. Yep. Now I'm a drug pusher. Yep. There you are. Yeah. What do you peddle in these days? Yeah. Anything good? Um, Anything I mean, we want? It's no, oh. not really. Oh. It's only good if you have psoriasis, which you don't. Oh want. So, no, no yeah. one. No. Yeah. If you have psoriasis, hit up Laura Lee Hunt. That's right. Or psoriatic <laughs> arthritis. But she's done some good stuff. You did um, genital warts. I used oh. to do um, genital warts. Excessive sweating. Excessive oh. sweating. Oh. Um, yeah. Migraines. I benefited from <gasps> that. Migraines. She learned really? a lot about migraines. I did really fun stuff at one point, and I did yeah. a injectable called Sculptra. That was yes. really fun. Oh, I've heard yeah. of Sculptra. Yeah. I actually yep. shadowed Laura Lee fun. for a day and we had the best time ever because right. I wanted to maybe do that. And then what happened, Alexa? Uh, it was too much hard work. Yeah. <laughs> and now, well, and now it was really successful. Real estate. It was, yeah. It was. I forgot that but you it was came so, out with yes, me. We had so I forgot much fun. that too. Right. Meredith, then you said that. Yeah. It, it, was, it was so fun. Yeah. I think I forget that too. Yeah, yeah. you forgot. Yeah, super fun. Well, ladies, yeah. we're on the eve of Thanksgiving. We are. Yeah. Something that we wanted to talk about is fashion at Thanksgiving. Yes. yes. Ah. So, you know, it's a big eating day, but it's also you might have guests or you might go somewhere. Based on your day tomorrow, what will you be wearing? Well, I would like to say after this, I am going right to Bliss Boutique in Easton. Mm. I already texted Nina and I huh. said, pull all your sweater dresses. Thank you. So she said, they'll be going in the downstairs and pulling me clothes. You so Because I'm kind of a VIP at Bliss. You Alexa, I'm not going to lie. Shout out to Nina. Uh, let's also mention that Alexa got a blowout. Oh, this I did. Morning. I went to makeovers. So pretty. So I had pretty. a gift card and I had a fabulous guy who did it. Looks so His nice. name is Joe. He did Paris Fashion Week. Wow. So you are but, you you did have your hair done. Yep. And you're going to go with the sweater dress for tomorrow. So I feel like that is a good it's extra but it's also comfortable. Last year I did a, a sweater dress too and it was cute but you can still stuff your face. What are you going to wear for a shoe? I right. like to wear a boot of thick. I like a heel. At home. Yes. Oh, wow. I, I'm always in a heel. Really? Wow. I'll have to show you. What are the the wedges I the boot wedge, like you know. Yellow. What are they a booty? Like a, yeah, like a with um, a with a heel. Yeah, yeah. I like I know that. What you're talking about. I don't know what you're I like about. that vibe. Even a tight 
Could right. be cute. Oh, tights are, yeah. I love, I kind of love it, a sparkly tan. Ooh, so sparkly. We like to be extra okay, on well, holidays. Stephanie, yes. now Alexa is dressing like that at home for the Yeah, because event. what does she really have to do tomorrow? Got it. <laughs> yeah. I am making Show a sweet potato cast. Oh, this is to day get the three. Three days ago, I said, could you set up the bar so I know what we have and what we don't have? That was three days ago. Is it set up yet? Oh, um, no. Everything is set up. I just have to put the tablecloth. And I just went you to Shoveltown and got more alcohol. Oh. So you're welcome. <laughs> oh. well, and she did tell me that she would get everything done. She, I said, this, I get it done in my own way. I don't like deadlines. Some people work better under pressure. I do. I'm yeah. a procrastinator, and too. it's going to be done, and I don't need mother's passive-aggressive drama. Ugh. I just don't need that. Well, you know, it's, as long as you outline it and she gets it done by the event. Yeah, so what do you care? It'll be done. She did run to White's Bakery, White's, and, and get got the turkey um, cake. I wish I took a, do you have a picture of it. It looks so like cute. a butterball it is turkey. the cutest really thing cute. I've ever she seen. And they have stuffing. Like it's made of cake, but they have the stuffing. Guess how much it was. So it was $45 and I don't and care. And we don't care. Money's no object. <laughs> Money's no object. <laughs> money comes, money goes. I said, it's mother, I'm going to slip your Amex. <laughs> True. Oh, I, I love that. Mother's Amex. Wait a minute. When you move, are you still going to have my Amex? Oh, absolutely. Well, yeah, but you're you... not really buying anything for the house anymore. We'll have to talk about that. Mm. Where are you moving? Laura Lee, tell Laura I'm Lee. I'm moving to Dorchester, Lee. Lower you Mills. Are? Yep. No it's big way. stuff. Yep. Um, it's what basically hell? on the Milton line. My okay. friend Alexa. I love that area. Yeah. yeah. She's sort of the tanning yeah. studio. Yeah. 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 So we are moving in together. That's so And this is at 27 years old. We talked about this a little bit last time, but I'm finally ready. Larley, here's I the turkey cake. Oh my god! Meanwhile, it looks like a real turkey. Yes. Oh, it's adorable. Oh god, it's so cute. Yeah. I love we it. We love white I love it. That's great. Yeah. So. Um, well, exciting! Congratulations. So I'm moving out. Thank Where you. Where are you moving? January first. Awesome. Mother That's said, "Do not expect her to be there on moving day." Oh. Yeah. Mother will not. Do oh, that. I don't. I don't do that. Yeah. Yeah. She said, you "Text me when it. Yeah, text me when this. you're moved in, and I'll come for a drink." Yeah. I think that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. And what there's going to do. There's right. some great restaurants there too. So Navarro, come and have dinner. Yeah. Oh there's yeah. Great, yeah. That's a great area. It's, Everyone knows that I am not on setup or cleanup committee no. ever. No. We talked about this, I think, a little bit, and I would take a page out of your book. So what Stephanie does for hosting is she keeps them in the metal pans. Nice shiny oh, pans. Okay. And then when they're done, they get thrown in the garbage. That's great. We love to just. Right. So it's today so we're easy. cooking. Today we're going to be cooking the stuffing. Okay. And we're going to be cooking the macaroni and cheese. Yum. And we're going to be cooking mm. the sweet so potato good. pie. And we're going to be cooking one more thing. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. So all that's going to be cooked today. And it'll be in the tins that it'll just be in get the thrown tins. away. Because you can just reheat yes. it all tomorrow. Yes. Throw it in the oven. It's so easy. I have my second perfect. refrigerator in the, in the garage. It's perfect. That's mm-hmm. perfect. Done. Yeah. yeah, Laura Lee. That's perfect. What are you doing for Thanksgiving? Hey, well, so I'm hosting. Um, it's a little bit of a wild card because I have a caterer. So through my job, I do a lot. I'm of obsessed catering. with Laura. That is and absolutely. I'm obsessed brilliant. with her. That is you don't have to give the details of the caterer. Okay. So yeah. basically, he just said. I'll take care of everything. What that means, I don't really know. I just know that tomorrow, hopefully by 2.30, I'm going to have food. That's all I know. So I'm it's a little upset. scary, but... No, that's the best thing I've heard in a long time. Have you ever of. cooked your own turkey? No. No. That's why I figured I wouldn't start this year. No. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm doing a new thing this year. She said no. I, I, am, will not be doing I am using cheesecloths over my turkey. So I will be dousing the cheesecloths oh, in lots of butter. Mm. <laughs> and then you drape them over the turkey, Yum. and then you can still baste. It's going to be so moist. Oh, but yeah. what's going to be very interesting this year is Tony is doing the deep fried turkey. Ooh. So he's already made the brine today. So, I'm so the excited. turkey will be soaking in the brine. So we'll have one deep fried Perfect. and one regular. Okay. Oh, Mayor, why do I feel like a deep fried turkey is like your like your family would love that? Like I feel like that it only takes like an hour is a, to would be a Hennessy favorite. She's not interested. No, her people don't really? like turkey. We're not people. having a turkey. You're not. You're not. Nope. What do you have? What chicken. Are we having? Uh, we're having. That is un-American. Yeah. Actually, I do need to. I print up the menu. Um, roast beef. Wow. Oh. Okay. Okay. We got it from the butcher in in uh, East Bridgewater. Croquettes. Oh, I bet it's yeah. going to be yeah. delicious. Yes. And um, what does the roast beef come from? Like what animal? Is I think that? it's a, a, cow. Cow? a cow. Yeah. Okay. So right? there were cows back yeah. in the yeah. day. Yeah. I mean, that's the type of roast we got. You well, can probably Brookie, get a different type of a roast. Brookie, 
our friend Brooke, Brooke on the team, she's going to Thanksgiving, and her aunt said, we're not doing turkey, sorry. We're doing eggplant. They're doing, like, an Italian well, vibe, which I love. You know, I mentioned this to somebody else, and they said, oh, we're not doing a turkey either. I kind of love that. But so, people don't love, not everyone loves turkey. I do love a turkey with the gravy. Mm. It's a replication mm. of back mm. in the day when the pil- there was turkeys <laughs> running around, right? So they... Yeah, I mean, and for me, them. the turkey, the stuffing, mm. the cranberry, the gravy, all mixed together is like the most delicious dish it in is. the world. Mm. But you know what? I don't care. I don't. I don't. I'm not tethered to tradition. So right. I, it, everybody, tethered. Yeah, writes down what I'm they tethered. want. I'm kind of. I'm <laughs> not gonna so lie. Tethered. I'm very tethered. I'm, and if I didn't have turkey, I I'm trying to be <laughs> inclusive, but I'd be pissed. I'm handcuffed and tethered. Okay. <laughs> Listen to this, my friend Heather. She went last week. She. Killed her turkey by herself. <laughs> Chopped the head off, oh my gosh. the feet, That's plucked awesome. it, did whatever you needed to do. It goes home in a right. trash bag, and that is what her family will. You eat know what, Meredith? Tomorrow. You are who you hang out with. Oh, oh my I mean, gosh. that's a little by to, to that either. Wait, the, do you think she? So she really she chopped the head off. Yes, is she like, that, a, that, is she like a hunter? Like, oh, okay. You guys discuss amongst yourselves. I'm okay. going to pull it up. This is I, a I, that's a bit I'm just laughing. Can we picture us three going in the woods? <laughs> Actually, Bo, he, he would I do love go that. I with Bo, so I've but learned to do these things. Can we but... pi- picture us three? Because she would do it in a minute. Meredith would do it. Get, hunting a turkey, no, no. killing the turkey, no. deheading, the shop, beheading the turkey. And then they run around still. Yes. Supposedly. And then cutting off the feet. Okay, and right then plucking. Here. Oh, Please. So sad. Right here. Man, I don't That's want to see the before. I'm not looking. No, I'm not looking. Super sad. I will. I'm yes. the type of person. Lola, like, <laughs> I'm not looking That's at all. No, no. Wait. Oh. To me, ignorance is bliss. I don't want to see. Oh, I don't want to see right. the before. I now, don't want to see it living. It's so now sad. Now I don't yeah. even want to eat turkey yeah, tomorrow. I do feel Mother's going to claim one, veganism now. This is first what she one, does. First one <laughs> headed to the bucket. I'm not looking, Meredith. Stop showing. Yeah. She No, she doesn't. I mean, I respect what the is process. That? I just don't want to be involved in it. This is where they pluck it. I don't want. Did they? I don't want to see the plucking. So some Feathers. kid has That's it. Up. Meredith, I'm, I'm only eating really... mac and cheese Meredith, tomorrow. Meredith. Thanks, Meredith. <laughs> Meredith, I have to Meredith you. Meredith single-handedly ruined my Thanksgiving. <laughs> a little kid at both schools. So my son is, as you guys know, six years old. Alexa oh, used to babysit. I used to babysit. And, and, and now Meredith's got a shay, baby, uh, which I love. Yeah, it's right. like a whole it's so it's great. circle of life. life. Yep. Yeah. Well, there was a little kid with a bandage on his hand. And I was like, Aiden, what happened to your hand? And he goes, I got a turkey bite. Do you believe that? How, how, did, the, how yeah. did, where did the turkey? But I don't, do you, do you believe that? That's yes, turkeys like are nasty. Yeah, they're, I they're, they're like, nasty. Where did he see I don't the like turkey? Them. I have to ask Well, maybe mom. because they know, know people want to eat them. They live well, around the corner from is what it is. way. So I assume it was in his yard. But unless that was a tall turkey tail. I don't know. Honestly, was it a tall no. turkey tail? <laughs> no, turkeys need to get to the bottom turkeys of this. Can, Do you guys remember the turkey at Five Corners yes. in Easton? Yes. yes. It was like a monumental turkey, yes. and then I think they shot it, didn't they? they did. Well, because he started pecking at people well, on motorcycles. But see, this is true. They're vicious, and then they, had to, they had to put down the turkey. Yeah, okay. R.I.P. Oh. But I don't think you can just eat those ones. I, I don't oh, think why? you can just, I don't think a lot of turkeys are good eaten. Well, because I think they have rabies and all that, right? I don't know. I, Alexa, I think you're making that up. I am. I'm absolutely making that up, but it sounded right. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah. Okay, wait. Can we go back yeah. to attire? Because I do obsess over this. Well, what are you, Mer- Meredith? What are you wearing? Oh, attire, attire. Are you wearing a long, a, the long furry vest? Probably be a vest. A long vest. If <laughs> Meredith is not in a vest, vest. then she's not herself. I know. I've, I've adjusted a little bit. She said, Laurelie and I are wearing vests." <laughs> yes. Yeah. I said, Alexa, what are well, we going to wear? you used to wear a beautiful fur vest. I do vest. have a fur vest. So I always made fun of in a kind way, Meredith, our whole <laughs> lives, because she always wore vests. And I always thought vests were very, like, like I don't know, yeah. vesty. Like, I just, I don't know. She called me a vest girl one time. You are And I was like, I am not a vest well, girl. And she goes, Meredith, you are a vest. how many vests do you have yeah. in your closet? And I was like, oh. Actually, can we get a head count? For next <laughs> yeah, we, yeah. Over or under 15. And, and what do you think? In. 10, 15? Oh, no. 15. No, I Meredith. Really don't have that Meredith, many. let's Meredith. be honest. Easy, easy she has them. Like easy five. 15. Like five. Yeah, five. <laughs> so <laughs> to her credit, back in the day when we went to UMass, any. she was 40. So, and back then it was like, there was no so cute one. I was a sporty best girl. It was all like. <laughs> She's sporty spice. They yeah. were all like, you know, like, like, like the, North Face um, and like all, they were, she was very sporty and outdoorsy. The, so, and I wasn't like that. And, no. You know, I was like dressed up and like. I love the so Marlon Florally you masters. Um, yeah. You were a hippie that, I, that I, time. Okay, I was. So you could also make fun of me. Marley was a cool 
yeah. Be there. And Meredith yeah. was a vest girl. Anyway, yeah. at some point in my life, I am going to create a vest company. Yes. yes. What will it be called? Don't give away the name. Somebody okay. can oh, steal yeah. it. Yeah. This is oh, your, yeah. It's a good yeah. one. Yes. It's oh, like Vineyard Vine. She yeah. is also can going you? to be writing a book. Yes. She will own a vest company. Meredith, yes. you'll be busy. Yeah. She will I be a bazillionaire because she'll have won the lottery. Yes. Oh, yeah. And, and she sells a lot of houses. And, oh, and, she and she's a mega houses. mega yeah. realtor. Yeah. And you guys all Tina Fly leader. Fisher. Yeah. I can't believe you guys are all going into business together. School bus driver. Like, how amazing. <laughs> You're how amazing. Right. Yes. We're joining forces. Yeah, it's so awesome. 11 people. We had our first meeting yesterday. We did. How do you think it went? Excellent. I think it went good. Yeah. So exciting. I thought it was good. I thought it was good. I would love feedback. to be a real estate agent. Blind team, what we should you join the team? I want to be one. Well, <sighs> the last get together I had, so. um, yeah, I, I hey. might be wearing my pleather jumpsuit. Ooh, I love that. That sounds it's, fabulous. It's, um, it's, um, Mother, you were claiming oh. leggings the other day. Wait, it's um so, not sleeveless. What is it called? A tube. It's a tube. Yeah, it's tube. tube-ish. Okay. It's a tube, one-piece pleather with a tie. I got it at Mission in Canton. Oh, you sounds be cold? so nice. And it's adorable. No, we, the Weinstein sweat. I will be oh, wow. sweating. Really? I'm not sure I'm going to be wearing that. What will you wear for a shoe? I usually start in a heel. And then she puts on. And then go down to a, a low shoe. Yeah. yeah. Like a slide. I will, wearing, I will be wearing heavy makeup. <laughs> and I might do a glitter eye. Ooh, yeah. Who's nice. to say I shouldn't? I yeah. think you should. Right. Love Why it. not? Love it. Yeah. Lola, what about but, you? You know, so I don't. I used to dress up like you, ladies. Sound yeah. like you do. Like I used to do heels and always look nice. And now I've kind of resorted or reverted to mm-hmm. or what the word is, mm-hmm. but to more comfy, like mm-hmm. not necessarily leggings and like a sweatshirt. Not not that comfy, but, but like like a sweater, like a dress. Yeah. Like no, yeah. I wear like sometimes like a dress, but like a comfy dress, so that way. That's could, big and flowy. So yes. that way, if I eat too much, right? Hotel, See, I think the dress is cute. the way to go. Yeah, that's what I want. And to then flats, but yes. I'll wear like fl- I'll wear yes. like Uggs. Sometimes I'll just wear Uggs with that. Oh, I, yeah, but that's cute. Uggs are in. Dress or Uggs like are in. So yeah. adorable. Yeah, I, nothing too fancy. Because I'm at my house. I don't know. I got. I got. I don't. I got lazy. I guess we're just extra. Lazy. Not really. Well, I don't yeah. know if it's you got lazy or maybe maybe the maybe as a culture we've kind of transitioned yeah, a little bit maybe because i used to dress up for every holiday like go all out with, well you know what i think it is kind of i'm jewish so i don't really know but do, oh. do you guys get for pits and for puddles for christmas wait what <laughs> do you <laughs> it's is that yiddish for pits and for puddles it's kind of um do you guys go do you dress up for christmas usually christmas well, eve christmas day like, same thing kind of right to I each go, their own i go fairly comfortable i mean i would never like hang out in my pajamas but <clears throat> I can't imagine that I would you wear a You probably have a Christmas vest, don't you? <laughs> I do. Of course you do. I think that's when I first met Meredith. <laughs> in a Christmas Seriously. vest? <laughs> you want to hear how I met Stephanie? So we were uh, at the office Christmas party at uh, Susan Johnson's house. Shout out to and Dizzy. I'm pretty sure I had just started a couple months ago. Yes. And I wore, because I thought it was funny, <laughs> a cr- ugly Christmas vest. Oh, God. Well, I wasn't far off. And <laughs> I spot on. quickly realized that I was the only one wearing an ugly Christmas vest. And so I look over at my friend Joe and I said, Joe, I don't, I don't think anybody knows that this was a joke. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, me either. And that's what's really funny. <laughs> and then in walked Stephanie and it was like, the light sparkle. Oh. Was she in a tutu? She had on that was her tutu a days. Strapless, yep. black sequin jumpsuit yep. with a flared leg, and it was like the music <laughs> came on, and I was like, I need to be friends with this woman. Dark She's party. gonna yes. better my person. Well, let me yeah. add, that's when I was a size zero. Yeah. You well, know, you could just you walk know. in and pick anything up off the rack. <laughs> I think I had got that sequin jumpsuit from BB. Oh, I love oh, it. Oh, love it. it was just all that and more. Love now, I, you I told me it. that this was your mom's first spray tan. Yes. So that blows my mind. You've impressed. never had a spray tan. Well, you guys are always tanned, I feel like, anyways. You're always tanned. Well, so Both we, you. we love the bed. As I enjoy said. the bed. Oh, is that why? I yeah. thought it was your heritage so, or something. Yeah. Well, <laughs> no, I honestly, I found I have like yellow undertones. Like, I get yeah, like really you, pale. Oh, really? I yes. thought you guys were just. I, I don't know if Jewish people well, are tanned a lot. I, I'm pretty I tan. tan. I get well, tan in the summer, but like the winter, I said, Mother, it was $10 spray tans at Tanarama. 
Friday. Yes. Right. I'm going. Um, <laughs> well, so, of course. Right. So I said, Mother, Mother was stressed with Thanksgiving prep. I said, we're off to Tannerama. Yeah, I had, no, I had Thanksgiving paralysis. Understood. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you know, mom, you sit there you look, and you can't do yeah. anything. You look dark. I anything yet. So my mom yeah, said that right. she, it didn't take, she doesn't like, oh. she wasn't a fan and she's going to stick with the bed. I love the bed. I like oh. the bed because I go to sleep. Yeah, you can take a nap. I know. And I do it after I get my hair done. Right, because I'm just in that relaxed so I mode, feel like and then I'm exhausted. So I go tanning. Laura Lee is like the OG spray tanner. Like when I would babysit, she would be like, "Oh, I'm grabbing a spray tan." Then she'd go out and she would look fabulous. Like it would be like a beautiful glow. <laughs> she'd go out and have like it looked so good. And I was like, "I need to start spraying." Yeah, because of Laura. What's Lee? the frequency that you have to spray tan? Once a week. It's however often you want to go. If I, I would do once a week if I could. I, I do mean, it for I, occasions because I don't yeah. really have time. I know. Why does it take a long time? Well, then no, you have to you sit have to, in it. And, yeah, it's like it's a process. You, uh, know, you have to go take your time out of your day to go and. To be honest with you, I couldn't, I couldn't yeah. hear what the woman was saying in the booth. You have to follow the directions. So it's yeah. like you see. So you have to put these plastic things. These um, plastic. Yeah, like things, things on your, on your feet yeah. because it gets on the bottom, and then you stand in naked. The, yeah, yes. naked. If you want to, but yeah. And then the yeah. woman goes. I couldn't hear anything she said. <laughs> she literally you have says, to like stand like this, <laughs> lift yeah. your right arm, yeah, so lift your you left arm, and turn right around. Yeah. Do you think the secret video cameras in there? I sometimes I, I do. Yeah, I sometimes wonder there's too. Gotta be. Well, there's, there's been a lot of t- no Tanner and would never, but there have been. We know, I've seen we cases know the, where these poor, un, like, girls go in and there are videos of But them. we know the Great. owner of Tian Rammer yes. brought in. We He's love, wonderful. Oh my God, he seems we, like a really nice guy. He we love the nicest him. man. Yes, we love, we love him. him. Yeah. Now, when Alexa and I walked in, it was fascinating. And we also have a fascinating fact Ooh, about what gender and age group tans the most. Oh. But before we get into that, Alexa and I walked in and there was a tanorexic Man, it was. No way. Really? It was. You know, Tan Mom. No. Do you, you don't know Tan, tan Mom? mom? I, oh. oh, I do. She, Let she me pull up like, Tan Mom. She was a tanner. <laughs> no. So this guy was. She tanned her baby. I pinned herself, I believe. Yeah. Well, yeah. no, that was Kim Lazarian. She tanned <laughs> her baby. She put oh, oil so on her good. baby. Yeah, but um, no, this was like. Do you ever like? I looked at him and like my spine shivered. Like yeah. I got it's like, like achy because it was like s- gross to me. Yeah, it wasn't because I know it was like. It was like leather skin, mm. leather. Yeah. So you guys, it's legitimate. Guess who, leather. Guess who is the biggest group that goes into Tanarama? I would think eight, fifteen. No, what do you think? Eighteen to twenty-five year olds. What gender? Okay, I would say female. Okay, okay. Meredith, Meredith, what do you think? Twenty-five uh, year old females. Well, guess what? You are both very, very wrong. Huh. The average person. Well, goes, this is from my friend who worked there. Okay, she, so she, she works at Tanarama. She worked she there for years and years and years. She pulled the data. She pulled the data because okay. she was there in person. Well, Alexa, tell them. It is like middle-aged men who work blue-collar jobs. Construction men. No. Like, cons- oh, I, and I've been there, and I see them coming out of the booths, like running really? out. It's me- like 40 to 50-year-old men. In, so strange. In no, construction outfits. 30 to 45. Tim, Like Timberland boots, like... Construction blue collar workers. That's so like using the stand up beds. <laughs> Meredith, what do you have to say about I that? I am speechless yeah. at this entire. <laughs> I don't have much to say. Can like, you believe this? I so, I feel like this is a, like almost like an underground scene. Yeah. Like yeah. it it's not people that don't really want to admit that they right. can. It's like, like, like Hobonichi. Like yes. Yeah. Her addiction. Yeah. You or, or like you know people who yeah, smoke but yeah. cigarettes. The construction yeah. men. It's but it's like, it is. Ones. But it's also businessmen. I know a few that when I'm in there, I'm like, oh, he's in here again. Really? Yes. And some guys, some guys go in there and they tell the person behind the desk, "Don't tell anyone I was here." Right. It's so. That, is there a physiological I've heard, thing that happens? Oh, I know someone that, when that you go slipped in my friend money and said you didn't see me. Uh, go I, buy yourself a coffee. So weird. Okay, this is what's but going course, on. Yeah. in the tanning world. <laughs> really? Yeah, because they think it's like a low key, like let me look. Well, because it's tanned, like you, I, don't I feel like I'm trying you don't want hard. someone to, you know, yeah. I don't know. Like like I don't want someone yeah. to know you tan. They're trying to. They don't. Want I don't care, but I think I'm. Yeah. I, mean, I, mean, I can't care. live like that. Like, I what tell would you do everything? if Sean Hennessy came out of Tanarama? Would you just be confused? You guys all tanning, like 
<laughs> it all knocks my socks off. I don't like <laughs> Now I want Sean Hennessy to get in the booth, please. I, Meredith, you cannot say that you haven't tanned. I have I tanned. Have. I, that yeah. was the thing. I would go, you know, we talked about this last time with right, in, in right, March right, right. when, you know, it's like so dreadful for so many months. <laughs> and then you go in and I imagine that I'm drinking a Corona and yes. in Mexico, that's kind of my vibe. Listening to mm-hmm. the, It's such a good it meditation time. Yeah. What about it Meredith saying body. people yeah. with seasonal depression? Just go outside. I'm like, Meredith, that's <laughs> the <laughs> worst advice I've ever heard yeah. in my life. You can't say like, that to a depressed person. Yeah, like, okay, say. I'm going to go see, stand outside in the 13 degree weather with windshield. Let's just put it out there. Meredith would be a terrible therapist. therapist. I just yeah. said that to them. <laughs> it's like I have someone, no tolerance. I am the It's like someone who's, I'm so depressed. Me. Okay, then stop being sad. Like, <laughs> all right, Meredith. We were <laughs> say, when we were going to film the show a couple of weeks ago, I'm like, I am in the worst mood. She goes, thank you for sharing your feelings. She's like, okay. Anyways. Just stand oh, outside, okay. she said. So, oh I'll, okay. so I'm just saying, all the single ladies, if you're looking for a tan guy, oh, yeah, go no. to Tannerama. Go to Tannerama during all lunchtime. Set. All set. Yeah. I don't really. A, a guy I that feels like, tanning kind of creeps me out. I feel like there it is. Yeah. It creeps me out. That you don't like the guy tanning. Yeah, it's weird. Like, that's why they cares. sneak in. It's a yeah. little too vain. Like, uh, it's okay. If but I'm that's vain. okay. If I don't want my man to be vain. like, I don't but really like, care that what much. About if what if man, he's like, all right, Lolly, let's go. Tan. Let's go tanning. Like, I'll pick you up and we'll go to tanning. I'm like, wouldn't you be like, eh. yeah, yeah. Like, that's, unless you're going on a vacation, you don't want to get burned. I understand I get, that. But if you're just going because you want to look good for a guy, I'm like, that you should. Go what on. if yeah. your man? Go what work. if your man gets a full go set work, of highlights? Work. I'd be like, go no, go to work. What about the highlights? I got a full set of highlights. I'll get my, my highlights done. You what need if, to go back to work. Lo, you what about if a man gets a full set of highlights? I mean, no. I think it's a little too... I mean, I think it looks good, and I can I can appreciate it from afar. But, I don't think I, I would not want my man getting well, for, uh, highlighted. I think it's... Weird. What about cologne? On a special occasion. No, if I, I buy it for him, sure. On a special occasion. I like cologne. Because you like want to like the smell. Yeah. Marit, do you like cologne? Yeah. No. Me, I don't either. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Buy it for him. I, I like I like a delicious cologne smell. But I'm a migrainer like you. Yeah. yeah so, so we can't. Oh, yeah. yeah. Alexa, before she leaves the house, douses herself. Yeah. Well, now I don't. But now I can when I move out. Thank God. I'll be like. And you know why I don't? Because have you ever smelled a perfume that you don't like? Yeah. And it's horrific. Yes. It's the worst thing. headache. And it like, you obsess over it. So with that, I was like, maybe there are smells that I like. That somebody else does. Of course. And then they want to vomit being around me. So that's why I, I will say it. Meredith used to have a signature scent back what, in high school. What was it? And everyone like you had you used <laughs> to wear it? this design perfume, maybe or obset was it um, obsession? Or something? It was something in like a red bottle, and she always wore it, and it was actually beautiful on you. And it didn't, I didn't like on me. I, I was like a weird smell, but on you, but it you was liked, like, and everyone weird. was like, oh, she smells so good because some yeah. sa- some perfumes yeah. smell different on other people. Yeah, absolutely, it's a, yeah. it's a thing. It's your pheromones. Yep. I think. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Yep. My pheromones. Let's, your pheromones are pheromones. Oh, Lola wants to talk about a product. Oh, yes. I want to hear about you ladies. Oh, I want right. to hear yes, about this deep. foundation. So, so folks who are listening, we're going to do segments of our favorite product. And I only yes. ask because you ladies are so always so gorgeous. Why do you I look at Stephanie and not me? When and you. you and when you do and that. you. Oh, You're always so gorgeous. Uh, I'm, I'm wearing, wearing that comfort shoe today. What'd you say? I'm wearing a comfort shoe today. I see that. I'm wearing a doorbell. I'm wearing a Gucci sneaker. I don't want to brag, but I'm wearing my. Those are so cute. Love them. So oh, cute. those are Very cute. those are sold out. You cannot get those Stephanie anywhere. Stephanie left the platform. So cute. Oh well, I'm short. Mm. Yeah, it They're helps. Cute. Yeah, what I don't like wearing, wearing a flat I shoe. Have pilgrim boots on. Oh, I like. I boots. went to a pilgrim parade for. My you you oh. always have a good shoe. You Thanks. have the best shoes, the best cl- everything. Thanks. Oh, Alexa, so do you. I take cues from you. I always oh, did. That's yeah. I was one of the reasons I miss you. I love yeah, oh. the fashion. Laura, yeah, tell us you. about your um, foundation. So most oh, yeah. of the one that I found that I want to share because I love it, but I have really dry skin, so I have to have like a, um, like a wet. Yes, mm-hmm. yes. It's NYX. I need my, my yeah NYX. NYX. Yeah, and they make like a liquid, and there's like 50 different colors. What's the Where can you get that? And let me just show you the consistency of it. I know people on TV can't necessarily see, but it's like. It's a drop, so you can add it into your oh. moisturizer. Oh, oh I yes. like that. And it just like rubs on. This is so just CVS. For our listeners, yep. Yeah. Our listeners, it. it's oh. the NYX Total Control Pro oh, Drop NYX? Foundation. I, I say NYX. NYX, oh. NYX, whatever oh. it is. You know what? I might, I'm going to do a side by side with the Giorgio Armani. 
And it's like eight bucks. So that I need to. I should have got that during the Sephora sale. That is like I need to get that. Oh, is that a really nice one? But I got the Dior foundation and I love it. Because I used to do Chanel, I think, or Dior, one of them, and it was like a liquid too, and I loved it. Yes, I have the liquid Dior. Yeah, beautiful, but it was like a hundred bucks. Yeah, yeah. You're kidding. So I love it. Do you know somebody told me this? I'd have to fact check this, but. One of the CVS managers told me that CVS has a deal with the makeup company that you can try it and yes. return it. Yes. Oh, gosh, yeah, yes. That's, yes. Yes, that no is issue. true. Oh, I yeah, that is true. No. I do it all the time. Yeah, if I don't can. like the shade, I'm like, I'm not spending that $8. Yeah. I'm going to go back. <laughs> Yeah. Alexa, remember when I posted about that? Um, the Jordana mascara. The mascara. So I posted it on was Facebook at only about, at Walgreens. I'm like, you're you're no one if you don't have this mascara. It was like four dollars, <laughs> and I wrote, it's absolutely it life changing. Alexa well, Ventresco, shout it out sold to out her. all over the country, and I'm not kidding. No way. So because yes, I had friends in California, and I had friends in I think Florida. That might be an exaggeration. So, yes. No, I'm not kidding. This is not an exaggeration. It sold at all. out at the Eastern Walgreens. No, that's I not true. It. Somebody went into the Eastern Walgreens and asked for the mascara and the woman goes I don't know some movie star (laughs) talked about this mascara (laughs) now everyone's been coming in for it and we are sold out that's but yeah. people in Florida, now, can California. You get it now? That's great. I don't even remember. I what don't it was. think. Well, I don't so what Walgreens anymore. I don't even know where there is one. No. Wait, hey, wait. Isn't there one at, next to Shaw's? Is that a Walgreens? No, it's right here, isn't it? Oh. Or is okay. it Walgreens? Who knows? Know. I go to. Yeah, I'm a CVS I go to girl. CVS yeah. too. I don't even think they make it anymore. Let me look. Now, Laura Lee, do you have a makeup addiction? I kind of do. So we, does Alexa. We, yeah, she does too. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. another reason I miss her. She always had beautiful makeup. We always had the and we just. I mean, she goes, "Mom, do you want it?" She she's like, "Do you want any of this?" getting rid of it it was yeah. four shopping bags full of makeup <laughs> palettes that she never used lip glosses that she never used yeah that's an addiction yeah, yeah. Well, right because can't too. you like after a certain point like don't you know what looks good on your face well and so what doesn't? now in my older age yeah i'm just getting things that i love oh okay. but i still well, buy well no that's so prior I, you I, would you would look at a palette let's say it was like one that you had already gotten rid of, well, have it on but Amazon. you're trying it on again to say maybe this time it'll look good on me. Well, I have certain brands that I just know their stuff is gonna be amazing. Okay. Oh. See, I do it a little different, but yeah. I like the idea of brands. Yeah. I just do it more if it looks beautiful, and I'm like, oh, that could be fun. Like that's like how my mom, right. yep. like that looks like fun, and that right. might be fun. Like in, you know, the creative, yeah, like a creative touch yep. to like. But then you buy it, and then you're like, oh, I don't think I can really do blues very well. I might try it for a few weeks. Right, yeah. and then people are like anything, funny, and then I'll stop. And what color Charlotte eyes? Tilbury is amazing. Do you have hazel eyes or brown? That's the brand. No. Yeah, Charlotte. It's at Sephora. Yeah, it I is don't think they're as dark as yours. Oh, I'll have to try. No, no excuse brown. me, Laura Lee. Wait, you have Doctor Kozal in Easton. When I went for my <laughs> eye appointment, he said you have hazel eyes. Hazel. Okay, You're I'm a hazel. hazel. Okay. You have hazel. You're brown. I have brown. We're, yeah, me I'm and brown. Harley are brown, right? Yeah. yeah. Let me see. Yeah. yeah. yeah we have, you have a light. So brown. I actually like don't mind like yeah, the lighting, but yeah. light brown. Like yeah. a purple liner looks well, good on hazel. Well, that's what's fascinating oh. to me because you do. You will go the blues, not greens, but the, or purples. And it, it, it does tone. change you, the color of her it. eye. It looks I love yeah. when you do purple. Cool. Oh, yeah. Me too. Really? It's yeah. Because you're tanned. Because oh, your skin tone. See? Like it. It's your Venetian Is that black. what it is? Spray I tan. think it's because she's tanned when she... Well, I always think you're tanned. So oh, I feel yeah. like you can wear like prettier colors because it pops. Like, oh. Yeah. Interesting. When you have whiter skin, like it doesn't... Like blue, it looks a little bit not so great. Oh. Yeah. So, I can't do any shades of red. No. I, I don't... Make On the eye? Nope. What do you mean? Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. Well, I have a red palette. It's actually I, kind of fun. Well, I do like a, a dark maroon, almost like a brownie yeah. maroon. That's pretty that on the... A yeah. plum. Yeah. Yes. A plum. Yep. But any reds, it makes me look like I have a cold. Yeah. They'd be like, oh, she has pink eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Stay away from her. Mother, can so, you not cough in the microphone, This is please? my favorite product of, oh, yeah, of the year. Yours. Um, <gasps> one stick. I actually got one for Stephanie. Yes, you did. One stick. You can get it at Sephora. Nope, it's called One Size. I'm sorry, one size. I am obsessed and with that. This Wait, do you guys know? Obsessed. Do you know what Patrick Starr? M- yes. Do you I know, know Steffi Starr. So oh. he's also another star. He's Look that tip. Liner. He's an influencer, oh. and I didn't even realize this is his brand. Look at the tip. Oh. And I have his. That's it's awesome. wonderful. It glides on. on the planet. Is that it's, liner? That's eyeliner? great to let line the top. Yes. Love it. Yes. So oh. I have his, his face powder that I use. You know those little new triangle things that you... Yeah, um, the fate like yeah. a sponge, almost like that, but yeah. it's a little different. But okay. I have the powder, and it le- it makes you flawless. Like your pores, Ooh. I put it a lot over here near my nose, and it's the best. It's the one size. I think it's powder something. It's 
Uh, Kylie Jenner's makeup already sues well, it. I just feel like we can do a whole segment okay. on makeup. Yeah. Now, do you girls contour? When I go out, I do. Not every day. I contour my nose. I do. I contour my nose. Yeah. I put dark right around when there. When I go out, I go, say when I go so, out, I do here, cheeks, nose. Yeah. And then you make a three. I'm a base every day. Yeah. Girl. I do uh, concealer, foundation, powder to set it, highlight. What powder do you use? Because you always have a beautiful. I have a powder. new one. She's always had a great one. Skin. You have really good skin, but I do, I'm skin. big into the the highlights to get a little bit of a, a dewy look. What powder do you dewy? use? The whole I face. I don't know. I have to look at it. Do you know when I got it for? Do you um, use a sponge? I do. It's so important. I never understood yeah. it at first. I always thought they were gimmicky. No. Mother but now I'm like, oh, I get it. I I used to use a brush, make sure makeup. But I don't nice. love a brush. I guess I could. Yeah, I used to use so a brush. So I do the foundation and brush, and yeah. then I do that with the concealer. I feel I just like my skin absorbs it. color so much yeah. that I have to put on so much. Really? I like if I just put on a little bit, you can't even see it. Right. I have to keep putting it on. And yeah. Same thing with eyeliner. It's crazy. Right. Oh, and my, actually, yeah. Brooke, who does my hair, says she's like, your hair absorbs so much color. I have to put extra color on your oh. hair. There's something about my body. You're I, it's, it's, yeah. Yeah. It would be it. odd to me, I feel like, if you had foundation on. I don't wear foundation. Oh it's sort gosh, of like a, a woman with freckles. Yeah, but you put something on. on. I don't wear foundation, though. Well, what do you put on? Right. A tinted moisturizer? I just put on like a, yeah. And you'll do a shimmer, a highlight. I love a shimmer. I didn't do it today. Well, in the summer, I just do tinted moisturizer. Like a really, like a bare mineral. It's, I, that's, it's easy. Well, now well, you don't have to. My either. skin now, I have so some young. red Your blotches. Skin's gorgeous. Oh. If I didn't have red blotches, I wouldn't. No, okay. I would still use foundation. I do. I, just like I, it. I have freckles a little like bit. It. Yeah, and I feel like I just look like my skin. Oh, looks I love better. freckles. I don't know. I like, love. I think freckles. we should. What? Have, have a whole makeup. separate makeup show. Okay, I love it. We can do. We you could know do. I, I could talk makeup for days. Oh yeah, me too. I, I love, love it. it. You know who got me into makeup again? Meredith K. Key. It's all about. Yes. Really? Yeah. Mary Carey? She yeah. loves I was like a tomboy. Yeah. I, when I met Meredith, I used to play with Barbies Stop. in like eighth grade. No. And I was still a tomboy. Yeah. And she was like, oh my gosh. Meredith like, says you can't say the word tomboy. Oh, you can't say that anymore? Well, Meredith she says, says it's a it's a girl who plays sports. It's oh. a derogatory term. I don't oh. think it is. Do you? Kind of is. Really? Yeah. Tomboy? How about we just call girls? Athletes. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. You All are right. yeah. You are I an mean, athlete. But I don't You're know necessarily athlete. that it's an athlete. It could just be a like a girl you know, who likes to play, to play sports. Woods. Yeah, I used to play sports. But I used to be out in the woods and like you know I was like didn't you're woodsy. Care about... Yeah, you're, very, you're woodsy. Yeah, I was woodsy. Yeah. She I was don't woodsy. Know, but it just that's where Bo like, gets it. I wasn't into like. Well, I hear what you're saying there, for, but a lot of times people will say she's a tomboy. She, yeah, because she plays sports. Oh, Meredith doesn't right. like that. Oh, all right. Yeah, but I don't think I think that's out now. I don't think that people really say that. I've heard it fairly recently. Really. Little. I didn't know. It was on PC. I don't know. I don't know. Ugh, everyone, yeah. I, I was just saying like a girl who yeah, you, hangs out with boys and does boyish things too. Or yeah. Like, you know what I mean? I play I, with Barbies, but I also I guess I'm a tomboy. Yeah, you're kind of. Yeah, you What are do they call? Boy. Maybe we reclaim the word. Yeah. Wait, yeah. Adam just yawned. <laughs> <laughs> Adam. <laughs> Adam is behind you? the scenes here. Where? Adam, he's like, I can't. <laughs> and that was a full giant yawn. Oh my god! Oh my god! You guys, Poor guy. so I, I, we can't let the segment go without um, what I said this morning that I, what? I was kind of thinking about our group getting together, and of the four of us, I'm the only one married. Oh, mm -hmm. true. Yeah. That's mother, a fascinating mother was statistic, married. but she's not anymore. I know, right? Like, cool. yeah. I mean, I'm just kidding. maybe marriage is out. A lot, I mean, it kind of kind of is marriage. It is, but it isn't. I don't think it is. I just Having think. Having FOMO. <laughs> it's Sorry, changing. Sean. Do you want, do you want to be single? Uh, no, you. but being single is, I don't think it's like. The grass is always greener. It is. That's what I think. The grass is always greener. I've single, never been happier. No, you mean it's not always greener. <laughs> Oh, I <laughs> buy whatever I want. I don't have to sneak my bundles in anymore. Mm -hmm. Right. Oh, my great. God. I, so I remember that. I just, I love it. Yeah. And see, I've never had it, so I also am like, oh, I must be. It must be really nice to be married because then, then you have like a partner for a many but you different can still, things. No, but you then can again, always still about have being a, with someone for like forty years. Know. But you can have a partner, yeah. but you don't have to be married to them. Agreed. Like Agreed. how what yeah. Courtney and Kardashian okay. and Scott did before. Yeah. Well, well, just life. Part well, he was horrible. Look how that works. So, out. Yeah. Right. Well, now yeah. she's married. But I don't know. I think marriage is kind of weird. Mm -hmm. Weird that you have to sign a contract. Mm. Well, in yeah. Jew, in you know, for Jews, you have to sign a ketubah, 
Ooh. Right, but if you want to get out of your marriage, sign a then you have to sign a contract. Oh, right. Do I so have I, to sign a you know, you know what my famous Tubes. words are? And I don't know where I got this from. Don't marry anyone you can't divorce. Oh, yeah. I mean, Some people are terrible. Yeah, but it's true. Some people are terrible. That's great. To divorce. I love it. Don't marry anyone you can't It's true, divorce. though. It's true. I, I know How some many people, people have you known that have gone through horrific, horrible, and it's the, horrible divorces. The kids are traumatized, and it right. ruins yeah. everyone's lives. Right. And, and right. 10 years later, they're still fighting. Exactly. I'm like, it's how ridiculous. do you not know get along? No, it's very sad. Like, both move on. It's been 10 no, years. No, it's... I know some jealous yeah. ex-wives. Oof. Really? Yeah. That's so weird to me. I feel like once you get a divorce or break up, like, then that's that. I mean, you might go back once or twice, but I mean, if you're going to the point where you're divorcing, like, okay, like, then you're done. Like, bye-bye. Like, you yeah. stay, you know, you co-parent and be friendly, but like, you loved that person at one point, so why would you exactly. hate them? Better? Exactly. Exactly. Like, you know, but. Jealousy. I haven't been there, so I have no idea. Jealousy and well, interesting it's, phenomenon. It is. Yeah, times are changing. <clears throat> I think changing. they are changing. Yeah, I mean. I mean, they're always changing. I know, right? but yeah, then again, evolving. I go evolving. on Instagram and Facebook and everyone in my grade is getting married. I know. I, I'm like, I nice. really feel like they're getting younger again now. Oh, really? The kids are younger getting married, married. now. I thought they were waiting. Yeah, because it was waiting At some 30. point, yes, now they're well, not. Well, a lot of the now like, high school engaged. sweethearts, you know, I'm 27, so obviously right now is, you know, they've probably they've been together. Years. for like 10 years yeah. so they're like you know so I know Put a lot a of people that are getting married now in my grade huh. and I'm like I'm which that is Alexa, still single Alexa still you don't home. even like anybody yeah. you could have a boyfriend tomorrow oh, she's your beautiful and awesome she's oh, just yeah. like ew gross nasty no disgusting oh can we talk goodbye. about my dating app quickly oh, we're, yeah, we're, 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 so I went out for drinks with Sam Godfrey who was on the team and Sam said I want to see she's married she's like I want to see your dating app let me oh, see oh it was Sam that said that yeah so I was like, okay. And she goes, Alexa. I go, what? She goes, this is the worst profile I've ever seen. She's like, the pictures are good. The prompts are so stupid. And this is all geared to like, for you finding like a friend, like a, a girl your own age, like a friend. She's like, guys are going to be like, what the hell is this? No wonder no one's so, answering you back. So what is it? I get like, Alexa, like, can you read so, us your profile? Yeah, let's hear it. So let's I wrote, this is so Sam was horrified. This is on Hinge. Oh, so God. Sam. Hinge. Hinge. So there's Sam hinge, was horrified that Bumble. my simple pleasures. I wrote iced coffee, candy crush, and scrolling on TikTok. <laughs> you Sam sound goes, like Shay. Sam goes, that is the <laughs> weirdest thing I've. Alexa, that's so immature. Yeah. <laughs> Sam goes, no guy is gonna care about any of that, and that's weird. I'm like, oh, I happen to agree with her. And then, well, I feel like it's funny. She was being honest. No, I love, I go, Sam, I need this. I was dying. I love a straight shooter. She's like, uh, she goes, okay. She goes, all right, so let's, like, what are your hobbies? I go, drinking and eating. She goes, that's weird. She goes, Alexa, that's not a hobby. Like, do you like to hike or do Pilates or ski? I go, no. And she's like, okay, like, do you like dogs? I go, oh, not really. I can't deal with the shedding. She's like, that's. That's yeah, weird. She's like, I will not date a man with a dog. Go well, I will, but crush. I don't need a big. I don't need a big dog with shedding all over. I wear black See, every day. This is why she's single. Oh so, what else do you have on your? Well, profile? I thought this was funny. Sam, who, who her father owns Godfrey's Auto. I wrote this year. I really want to. That was a prompt, and I wrote, "Stop running over curbs." Okay. And that is funny, and people have laughed at that. And Sam said, "That's fine." Okay, so and you then get to keep one thing. Something that's special to me. I wrote. Extra dirty martinis with kettle one vodka and blue cheese olives. That's kind of special to me too, though. Well, it is special. It's very no, what it's, Well, what did Sam say about that? She's like, eh, but we needed another prompt. Oh, my So she's God. like, why don't you write, like, boating on Sundays? Like, oh, Sam, when's the last time I went boating on a Sunday? <laughs> on whose boat? Alexa doesn't even like boats. No. This is impossible. She's like, uh, you, she has no, Alexia has no like, hobbies. Do you want to come to my it. friend's giving on Saturday and like hang out with us? I'm like, maybe. Oh my God. Like, do you need a hobby, hon? <laughs> Seriously, I need Alexa, a hobby. I'm really worried. Oh, I love Why? You don't have a it's hobby? Funny. No. Alua, did you do an app? I did for a very short time. Which twice. twice. How for like is a it short like window. with a little bit older guy? Because my, I feel like everyone just wants like a hookup. I did it once, so you would. I mean, Jenna it profile was profile for me like 10 world. years we ago. Did she one. was so excited to have me We're like it. punching in and all yeah. of a sudden we hit send and it was like, <sighs> yeah. all these men ding, 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 just ding, were yeah. like, was it like a candy store? Was it plenty of fish? I forget what she, no, I think it was, I forget what you we I don't did. remember. I, it was like 10 years ago. It was somewhere you had to answer a lot of questions. And I think I did it, question. yeah, for like two weeks then. Yeah. And I, it was like overwhelming. So then I tried it again well, 10 years later. Wait, what's overwhelming? What, what happens? Because it's kind of. Like, especially if you're ADD like myself. Which, like, you're, there's 
you have to like constantly be like there's messages and thing like thing like people things people are, are happening you, so, right yeah. you have to answer, answer them back them and, and you have to answer back and then you're supposed to make a date and then there's a bunch of others and like it's too much like, oh okay but yeah. you know what's happening with my age group too like we're going on dates and it's a fabulous date and then we get ghosted yeah oh really? this is what's going on the guy said this was great. Like I want they to see plan you another again. date, and then it crickets. This happened to me. It and there's to my no, friend. there's no it's... hookup on this date. This is a dinner. No, this is wonderful sick. conversation, yep. drinks, kidding. getting to know each other. Fabulous date. Let's go out again. That's so weird. Ghost. That even happened to me. We were talking so about weird. ghosting. We went, and I was like, he was like, I don't get it. Like it's immature. Like just tell someone. I we had fun, yeah. but not for me. I'm like exactly. Right. Or I met someone else. Or whatever. crickets. She got That's ghosted. So but not you don't show up at the place where you're supposed God, to. God no. no, no. I was no. They no, just so they never reconnect. And- um, I think we chatted a little bit more, and I said, "Are we still on for Monday or what, Monday night?" And this was like. Probably six to eight months ago. I mean, I mean, not that's crickets a way to and never, really affect your ego. Totally. I'm like, she's confidence. like, I don't get it. Yeah, that's and to, then it's like, not, it's honestly, not you. It's not you. but it's embarrassing because everyone's like, how was your date? Like, when are you going out again? And then you have to be like, oh, they never answered me. Like, that's so embarrassing. Well, well I, I would imagine. Like, don't you think? Yes. Like, yeah. So. But I don't really... I, I don't know how that's even acceptable. So it's, it's but it's, it's well, then you don't want to look psycho and be like, hello. It just you, happened to another friend of hers. Same thing. They so had a fabulous it's time. Cultural Crickets. phenomenon. Right People now. just don't want to. So do rather things. than just like being real and being a man and saying like, or a woman yeah. and saying, you know what? Yeah. I'd like, it's, I had a great night with you, but you know what? I'm going in a different direction or yeah. whatever. Something, they anything. Something. Meanwhile, so like, I, I feel like we find that too. Cause you're the different age set here. So no. So I did it again. This is probably. I don't know, five years ago, for two weeks I was on and I had some real creeps, which freaked me out. So yes. I had to get off. But um, like, I was like, oh, people are weird. They're sending pictures. I'm like, I don't want selfies of you. Like, I don't like, ew, like that's, that freaks that's me out. That's a red flag to me. That's Yeah, weird. that was right. weird. Um, we and then I did see- meet a guy that I dated for almost a year, I think, or over a year, mm-hmm. who was super nice, a wicked yep. nice guy. Yep. So I didn't get any of that, but I didn't really, I wasn't on it long enough to, right. I just did two weeks. You know, you know what's weird too? My, I don't, tell me if this is weird. So one of my other friends went on a date. She's like. I had so much fun. Not, you know, I just didn't feel a connection. I hope, I'll, you know, you find someone. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. He goes, thanks. Can I get feedback? Uh, like, oh. That's something well, Meredith like, would say. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that if Meredith was dating, but she'd say, okay, great. He, Can he I was have like, feedback, I think please? Okay. I he think was like, okay. I think that's, well, what are you going to say? Well, I mean, okay. I know. So it's hard for you. It's hard for you. I mean, I feel you. like that's like, what, can I get feedback on why right. you... Th- you're like, like well, you, your, just, your hairline is thinning. Right. Yeah. But like, sometimes you just don't connect and you just, there's no interest. But if you're the personality who you are in this app to meet someone yeah. that you want to have a committed relationship with, and then that's how you're going to get there, is... The feedback? Yeah. That someone that's weird say, to me. Whatever. I told you, Meredith would want feedback. No, I, I do get if that. If I'm going to be in the app, I'm going to be like, hey, yeah. I'm there because you I, know I have an end goal. It's someone who actually cares. Yeah. It's I just mean, the right. problem is it puts you in an awkward position because right. they say, like, think, oh, I didn't think you were that cool. Or, you know, there's yes, people that you – that, so I have friends that go to a professional coach. Really? For yes. dating? There's professional oh, coaches. Really? They help you with your profile. Oh. You get a photo shoot. Oh, jeez. Yes. Wow. They spend That's a lot serious. of time going over your profile. And then you have groups. You break out into groups online and in oh. person, and you talk about the dating life. Um, and then if you go on a date and you're not sure how to proceed next, you reach out to your dating coach. <laughs> no way. And your dating coach goes, I like it. I mean, I this think makes this sense. Going I want to be a dating coach. I would love to be a dating coach. That's like hiring us for what we do. We're yes. guys. Yes. I would yeah. love yes. to be a dating coach. And let me tell you something. So one of my girlfriends started dating a guy, and I wasn't sure I didn't – I. Wasn't sure it was really going to go anywhere. Yeah. And I was wrong, I think. But she spoke to her dating well, coach, and her dating coach said, I like how this is unfolding. Huh. Well, mother is very judgmental as well. <laughs> One thing will happen, she'll go, I don't like them. Uh, I'm like, well. she's and then she no. goes on MLS and looks up their parents' homes and what they have. So I can't tell her any info. You know, it's the data that we have asked. Well, I know, yeah, and I, would, I do the same, but I don't need mother looking up people's you know, right. you she might wants think to her know someday. a little history. Yeah. 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 That's her job. But Laura doesn't yeah. usually thank me, though, when I do that. <laughs> yeah. Well, like, great. They... I'm like, oh, I didn't need to know. You're that. like, oh, they're in foreclosure. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't paid their, their mortgage. I'm like, darn, everybody seems so I'm nice. Like, oh. They're about to lose the house. But if they're yeah. nice, yeah. hey, yeah. you go for it. Do you, do you guys think that I've there learned. really is one person for everyone? Like, everyone has a soulmate? 
Um, Do you believe in that? I think for some people, I don't think that there's an answer, one answer for all. Oh, I, see. Yeah, I don't think so. Nope. You don't think this and is soulmate think, for everyone? But I think this is very important for young people. I think, and I heard a psychiatrist say this, and it's true, love is not enough. Ooh. It's not enough because yeah. guess what? You can love a million people, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. I love you. I love you. You can love so many different people for so many different yeah. reasons, mm -hmm. but you have to be able to grow yep. with that yeah. person. Mm -hmm. Because if you can't grow Amen. throughout the yep. years, yep. it is not going a to thousand percent. work. And yeah. I, so I love is not in my, enough. In the oh, back of my I mind love too. him. I love him. Okay. Yeah. Can you grow with him? Right. And that's really important. Yeah. yeah. And love doesn't pay the rent. Yeah. Exactly. Love doesn't pay the rent. True that, Laurelie. <laughs> love don't pay the rent. Unless you're a sugar baby. Then it will pay the rent. <laughs> Alexa did have a friend. Didn't you? Didn't yeah. She did, a, she did a date. It was in... Um, she went on Sugar Babies. It was Wait, down in Florida. Sugar Babies is a website? It was Seeking Arrangements. Oh. Is this an escort service? Essentially. Oh. oh. Okay. They just went out for dinner and she got paid. Oh. Took her out to dinner with them. Yeah. Yeah, she got oh. 500 bucks. Oh my gosh. Mm. Oh, wow. <laughs> and a free dinner. It was delicious. So <laughs> there might have been a makeout. Mm. I oh. feel like there must be a little more there. Yeah, there always Maybe. is. Yeah. There always yeah. is. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I'm, I'm not going to say anything else, but there was a little more. Well, yeah. ladies, we've oh. been we've been chatting for quite some time. This oh. is our longest oh my God. podcast. Yeah. Oh my God. I could sit here hilarious. all day and just. Well, you know what? You we have the gift of gab. Adam doesn't want to sit here all no. day. Adam's yeah. yawning. And Alexa, yeah. you have some yeah. things you have to do. I have to go to Bless. You, okay, oh. she has to see get paid Meredith. For her this outfit. is what oh, I'm what? Set, putting a tablecloth on the bar. <laughs> oh, and Alexa, did you ever call that guy that was looking? No, for I, I texted space? Brooke. We're calling him later. Interesting. Yeah. I said it's my on the to do list. list for she was at Brooke was at Barry's. I had a wait where, and I was getting my hair done. Who's Barry? Um, the the workout place in Boston, Barry's. Oh. So is your hair, can I have one more question? Is your hair always the shiny and soft? And I soft? do the, um, I she has beautiful hair. She does. Yeah, but I also do the semi-permanent gloss. Oh, it looks so nice. Which I love now. I'm like addicted oh, to it. So I do a, the gloss every time I get my hair done, but it washes out. But I could do something that's more permanent. This has been months. Yeah. Really? So pretty. So that's different than a keratin. Yes. Yeah. Yep. And, do and don't forget, she doesn't do anything else to her hair. So she right. doesn't get doesn't highlights. She doesn't right. do anything. Just, that was the first time oh, I've ever touched uh, my I hair color. I think we have to go. Oh. Oh. So we're getting in trouble. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is our Thanksgiving episode. Yes, this was so much fun. Thank oh you. my God, Laura so Lee, we love you. Oh, Laura Lee, we, we could, so we could talk it. to you. We for love Lala. Days, love. days, days. days. Hours Me hours. too. I'm yep. so comfortable. I, I know. I love I these love cheers. Yeah, this is great. We love everything. These are so fun. And we love Ecat. Yeah. They're so wonderful to us. Community. Yeah. Well, I'm Meredith Keach. I'm Stephanie Weinstein. I'm Alexa Weinstein. I'm Laura Lee Hunt. Thanks for joining us. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Happy Bye. Thanksgiving. We Bye, love ladies. you. Bye, ladies. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.